Hello everyone, it's Little Flame. Welcome back to my channel. I know I've been gone for a while. I'm finally settled into my new place. Like you can see that everything is still pretty bare. I don't have anything on my walls. I still feel like there's plenty to do and organize. There's still a couple of boxes that we I need to go through but I wanted to share a cool project that I've been working on this past couple of weeks and that is to show you how to design your very own sticker book from start to finish. I've always enjoyed collecting stickers and I find that there isn't a wide range of sticker books so I thought okay why don't I just make one and I think that the design turned out really really good and I wanted to share it with you. So first you're going to want to open Illustrator. Okay, so the size we're going for is going to be 6.9 by 9.8. So first I'm starting out with a dark background and the theme I wanted to go for was something nostalgic. So I'm going to be creating an old school loading screen. You can see that everything is pretty much using the rectangle tool. Pretty straightforward. I think it would be cute if it said something like loading stickers. So after this piece is done, I'm going to go ahead and make a search bar. You're going to see that a lot of these designs you can find online that are ready to use for your sticker book. I also made an image icon and feel free to use different tools to draw some doodles that you can also include on your notebook design. Okay, so now that I have some of these pieces ready, I feel like I want to add a anime sketch piece. So I decided to sketch something from Pinterest and bring it into Illustrator. So this is going to be one of my favorite tools. Once you have a sketch in place, you can bring it in and image trace it. There are a lot of options, but I'm going for the silhouette effect. And make sure you expand it right after so that you can control the pieces separately and bring in some color. Now it's time to put the pieces together. And then we're going to add final touches to the design in order for it just to stand out some more. Perfect. Oh wait, I think my laptop's gonna die. I'm pretty happy with the way it turned out. Now I'll just export it into a JPEG PNG file. Now that we got our design set, 
We want to open Valgrace. This site has plenty of customization options. Here is where you're going to be setting up your design for your very own sticker book. This site has plenty of options to customize your stickers, keychain, and all sorts of stuff. We are going to head over to more products and choose custom notebooks. Here you're going to select B5 for the design and you can see here they have some more information about their sticker books including if you want to make a front and back cover design. And of course I took this opportunity to make a matching back cover. I bought 5 books in total and once you place that order it's just a waiting game from here. I'd say the process is two to three weeks long. They do message you to send you a proof of your product before printing, which I found to be super helpful. I got to adjust my artwork a little to make sure I didn't lose any text or pieces I wanted to show on the book. So once the order got here, I was extremely happy with the results. They turned out perfect. And there's tons of pages for your stickers. If you like, I have four more other sticker books going out on Etsy. It was a lot of fun to make and now my stickers finally have a home. Thank you everybody for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe. Please hit that like button. Until next time.